Hello everybody, welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. Plus, yes, it's been a while, but the new DLC for Binding of Isaac Rebirth has shown up, and here I am playing it. I originally had something else planned for this slot, but um, there are still some issues that I need to work out for that, so instead we will be starting off this again. Um, yes, DLC is out. Uh, paid for it the moment it came out. Um, had some issues because it wouldn't install properly. I had to throw away my game, install it again. Turned out I lost most of my progress to pre-afterbirth places, then apparently hitting Alt F2 fixes that. And anyway, the only issue I see now is that there is a thing. Um, I'll sh well, there's actually two things. First of all, when we go to stats and go to items, every item I collected in Afterbirth is no longer seen as collected. So, hurrah for that. And of course the other thing being that everything I did in Afterbirth as far as endgame bosses goes and hush mode and greed mode is gone as well. At least I still have all my characters and I've already noticed there's a new one. Um, but yeah, other than that, I think I'm still at the point. So apparently there's now a greedier one. I'm guessing it's hard mode for greed mode. Sure, that'll work, I suppose. Um, so we need to get back into the swing of things, and what better way to do it than starting on hard with a new character? <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, sure. So what do you do? I don't know what you do. Uh, two red hearts, that's something. Um, I forgot what the controls were, but we'll... Okay, let's use the item here. How do I use this item? That did nothing! And it took six hearts, too. Well, six charges, too. Okay, so we do not use this when there's enemies afoot. Uh, could I not... I cannot shove the TNT around. Well, we're gonna have to let these guys go. That's gonna be a blast. <coughs> Literally! Well, let's see if I can still play this game. It's, I haven't touched this ever since I've played... and completed um, Afterbirth. So, yeah, some adjustments will have to be made again. But I'm glad to be back, I really did enjoy the game. <clears throat> um, so yeah, it's gonna be quite a while. I think I'm just going to try to remember that everything I've done is done, and once I've done all the new stuff, I'll call it quits again or something. Uh, that's like a crummy item, isn't it? Yeah, Judas' Shadow. Can't say I'm a fan of that. Mm. Well, what else can I try Void on? Um, I guess items. Consumables. Bosses. I don't know. Don't know what Void does. Man, it's gonna be quite some thing getting back into this. Though it does seem like my fingers still know what they're meant to do, so... Hey! What more could one want, right? I'm getting a lot of keys. Well, there's a void right there. Kind of looks like the... So you just spew out random enemies. Alright. I guess that's alright. I'll have to... figure a way to get that taken care of then. Probably sooner rather than later. Well, thank you for blowing yourselves up. Saves me the... a fork. Consume the enemy. Trinkets, right? That's a thing. Alright. Uh, we'll try Void here. There's a lot of pots here, but I'll wait until there's a consumable. We know it doesn't affect enemies. Or at least it doesn't seem to affect enemies. So let's see what it does with a consumable lying around. Uh, 
Um, doesn't affect consumables either. Mm. Oh, there's little Monster 2s now. Cool ish. I hope they're not too powerful, and they aren't. Okay. Get out of my face. Yeah, just go hug some fire and leave me out of this. Yeah. Okay. Double bombs. See if I remember how to use those. Yeah. Okay, we'll leave those until the end of the floor as is usual. <clears throat> I'm gonna beat up our boss, see if I still have that. Okay, I think our secret room should be down here, but you know, we've established that secret rooms can act a little funky, so to say. You're spewing out bombs now. I suppose if you enjoy that. Oh, they're bombedly fire. That's new. And annoying. <laughs> I'll probably be able to shoot out the fire if it desperately becomes a problem, though. But didn't you do something else? Uh, probably not. Again, it's been like Quite a while since I've played this. Right, he's dead, and we get Jesus Juice, which is good. No, we can't. Oh, it goes away on its own. It's better. Bit of a damage up, that's always nice. Is there anything left for us here? Yes, these spirit hearts or whatever they're called again. Pick this up right now. <clears throat> so, what do you do, Void? Is there any way we can figure that out? No. We'll probably be able to see it once we pick it up. You know, if we find another uh, space we're right, and we can check the description of that. Or we could go to the menu and check it from there. Uh, do I want to base the bomb trying to find a secret room? Sure. There we go. Now we got two more bombs out of it. Cool. Uh, let's use one here. Maybe we can get a mini mush or something. No. Let's use another one here. Two pills, huh? Health down. Wonderful. Well, might get the other mushrooms now. Alright, so that was an unfortunate one. Um, especially that, well, that health down was unfortunate. Well, at least we know what it is now, so... Also, the moment I booted this up, I got like a crud ton of... Uh, achievements that immediately popped. I'm guessing that's because stuff I already did in the original pre-DLC game. Um, notice there's a bunch of new challenges too, which I'll be happily diving into. Um, and of course... I was gonna say something important here. And I kind of forgot what it was. Oh well. So, Void. Um, so it doesn't affect enemies, does not affect consumables. I don't think it's going to be something idiotic. What the... Are you just, like, invincible till I take out everything else? Yay. They look like the stone statue, so that's why I'm... Go, yep, okay, they do die. Void, void, void. What else? I suppose if we find a crummy item, we can use it in the item room. See if it affects that in any way, shape, or form. So what's my goal here? Well, beat the game, I guess. Been a while since we've... Uh, done this so a simple warm-up run probably wouldn't hurt anyone. You know, get the lay of the land again and such. Uh, we'll wait on our boss until we get our item. It's only basement 2, but... So, having lost a whole bunch of crud, I really do hope nothing goes on with the uh, slot machines that we can still get. Brr. 
fun pills. Oh, uh, good stuff. Ah. Alright, come on. A battery, huh? Uh, let's put it on here. Mm, sure, we got plenty of stuff. Alright, so we just lost a bomb. Uh, mystery item. I think I'll just pick it up. <coughs> I suppose. Holy light. Okay. Um, I guess we'll go beat our boss, see if Satan has something to give us. And it's good old normal monstro. Hmm. It's probably like somewhere around a year since I've played this. I'm surprised I'm doing as well as I am. I guess you just don't forget about certain things. Huh? And I mean, after having played Enter the Gungeon, this is kind of like a cakewalk. Bomb seals, range up. I'll take it. Death's touch. Ooh, cool. Going back into that um, <coughs> sketchy mode straight away where we have only spirit arts. Okay, that's one of those other things that never change on my end. Go big or go home. Technically you are home, but... Oof, that's a pricey one. We do still have a Judicious Shadow, but I'd rather not use it. I want to get the achievements for beating the game with this character, not with... Uh, another one. Uh, store could theoretically be here. Well, I'm not store, but sealed room. Yeah, and it is. You give us a key. Um, let's go into our shop and see what the uh, donation machine has to say about life in general. Yeah, the thing's like chock full. I think I'm going to use my one bomb to get another spirit heart going here. Um, see if it does anything here. The uh, space bar item. Nope. Nothing. Hmm. Well, this is getting more and more interesting by the minute. Cool looking character. What was his name again? I. What? Did he just poop himself? He pooped a little. Ooh, mushrooms. Uh, I mean, damn, mushrooms. <laughs> Mushroom that spit out spiders and kill me straight away. Well, I guess we're going to be finishing this as Judas. We should have, like, a ludicrous amount of damage. Too bad we won't be getting any prizes for winning the game now, but... Uh, magician, yeah, that's homing shots. All right. Ooh, right. Uh, an HP upgrade, huh? <clears throat> Wish I got that a bit sooner. Ah, well. We still got Void, so we might be able to figure out what that will do for us. Um. Keep going. In this crazy world. So you spit out spiders and you shoot bullets. That's just being mean, isn't it? What? They can spit out invincible enemies? Holy hell. Another spider type enemy. Let's not try to figure out what that does. Instead just oh it drops a spawner once it's killed. Okay. Can't be bothered. <clears throat> Still haven't got the faintest idea about what the uh, void in there does. 
could be something like simple as it heals you when you hit enemies for a room or something. Maybe upgrades or damage when you get hit for a room. I really can't say. Agala's destruction. We'll keep that on us until we find a big room, I suppose. Pethro change. Okay, that's a reroll. Blank room. Might as well use that straight away. No idea what that did. Lovers. 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 So actually, we can make good use of that, I think. And by good use, I mean half use of it. See if we can let this guy uh, pay out. A pill for I can see forever. That's convenient. All right. Well, there's our boss. Might as well go pay him a visit. Let's see if you do anything here. Void didn't do anything again. Hmm. For a six room item, its use is eluding me quite heftily. Uh, I think I got enough keys. Let's switch this up. Range and luck. It's something. Alright. Which one is this again? Agalaz. Yeah, we'll take that with us. I suppose if we find a room with a bunch of stuff in it, we'll uh, pop it in there. Um, I guess we're done here. So do we take Hagalas or Magician? I think we're going to take Hagalas. Really sucks that we died that one time, but... See you there. You might think it's too dark for me to have noticed, but I'm still on you, man. Okay. So I guess we'll go about uh, this game the same way we did last time. Do a run, do a challenge, do a run, do a challenge, do a run, do a challenge. And then we'll look into uh, super greedy mode. I wonder if preparations were made so you can't just win the game in greed mode by getting a combination of a few select items. Big horn, you're new. Uh, okay. Yeah, just shoot your bullet straight into a wall, see if I... What? Oh, come on. You're gonna be one of those guys who just throws something in your face and why are you pooping out little horns? There's really no need for that. Okay, so in this guy, don't be standing still. Is what you're pretty much telling me. Okay, man. I'm gonna have to learn boss patterns all over again. Oh, come on! Is that HP up? No, range and tears. Oh, Krampus, that's actually good. Because we couldn't get an item from you anyway. Let's see if you got anything new. Krampus's head. Well, I'm going to be honest, I have no idea what this thing does. Let's use it one final time and then we'll go with uh, the head. What? So I used Krampus's head, it disappeared. Oh, I think I know what it does now. So 
So if there's a space or item, you use this and it takes over whatever it does, but you still keep that. So if I use this again in another room, the space or item, it will use that one. But why on earth would I want to do that? It's still six room charge. Uh, let's use the moon card, I guess. Huh. It's a golden chest, which isn't all too bad, but I don't want to get killed over it. Well, let's see if I can live long enough f uh, in order to... Wait, there's a black heart in the boss room? Failed to spot that. So if you live for another six, five rooms, which shouldn't be too much of a problem, uh, yeah, there is a black heart here. Cool. So that means if you use Void again, it should be Krampus's head, if I'm right about what it does. I still don't get why you would do that. I mean, the highest room charge you can get is 6, so you might as well take the item you're given it to start with, right? At least that's my theory, and I'm vaguely sticking to it. I've also heard that um, after plus is a hefty spike in difficulty, so once again I am still amazed that I'm alive right now. Uh, I wouldn't mind going for those tarot cards, but giving up my final two bombs is probably not the wisest decision at the moment. Uh, we do have enough to go to our Shambiner or Spirit Art, potentially, if there's one available. The bonies, remember that. Come here, bony. Bony! Yeah, he did. Just keep his mouth shut until he's the only one left, and then we can flip him out. <clears throat> okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, I don't want that. I'm fairly sure of it. Polyon. That's our name. Don't wear it out. And he's dead. Alright, so no spirit heart for us. Keep in mind, we don't have any extra lives left. Resistance rune will come in handy. Did that one guy fully pay out, or was that not on this floor? I don't think it was on this floor, right? I've got all the lover's cards and stuff, or was that here? No. Hmm. I guess we'll be leaving now. One bomb for one chest, I guess that can be worth it. <laughs> Especially when you just get a bomb back. Okay. Can't do anything with these. <coughs> uh, let's try the uh, head. Yeah, so it does work like that. I don't really get the point. Unless. Unless, of course, I see a different use, namely it stacks. As in if I suck in another space bar item, I'll get that effect as well as Gramps' head. Hmm, that could be useful, especially if I can find something along the lines of a uh, Book of Revelations or whatnot. Still, it's kind of surprised that I still know all that, but hey. It's better than being, ooh, what's this? Ooh, what's that? There's already enough of that for the time being. Okay, come on. Open wide, open wide, open wide, open wide. Not that one, but... Yeah. There you go. Come on. Come on. 
come on. There you go. Well, so far we're doing fairly well. If you ignore the health situation. Yeah, get wrecked. This shouldn't be too bad. Piercing shots. Should slice through these guys at a rapid, rapid pace. I wonder if it works on shop items too. The spacebar item that is. Active item, I should probably call it. it won't be a while until I do spacebar here. Again, using controller, so. No idea what 4 does, but I don't think it rerolls the run, so. See if I can get the spirit heart out at least. Yeah. It did something. Okay. Two keys for us. some stuff is was a good deal, especially because there was a bit of health in there. Alright, let's see if this is another space but right, and we'll use the head again and see if it Monstro's lung. I just hit my headphone. Do I want this? Ugh, not really, but whatever, right? So do I just like blow out a bunch of sides now? Yeah, kinda. Alright, that'll do. Range has been Oh no, range is still fine actually. Come and get it. Eat it. I'm drowsy. Uh, controls aren't changed if that's what you're asking. Not quite sure what's going on. What level is this? Steps 1, so we can easily go in here. No problem. Monstro 2. <coughs> Nearly killed him in one volley there. Speed up, huh? Not what I had in mind, but whatever. Alright. Get wrecked. Hey, look up. Right, lucky pennies. That's a thing, too. Yeah. That didn't go well for you, did it? Alright, let's see. There are the pill bottles and I let's try to use the item here. Nope, doesn't work. We'll buy this though. And we'll fill this back up to 998. <clears throat> Keeping it at that because um you know what it's worth the experiment actually. Oh, I got the mom item school. Okay, so that's now a normal item. Do I still have enough rooms to fill that up. Yeah, because it looks like there's a battery in the dice room. So we'll go and get that. We'll try the item again. See if it sucks up the pill bottle and gives me a pill whenever I use it again. <sighs> Things I do for science. Yeah, it does. Okay. Problem solved. Let's use a spill. Couldn't can be a health down. We're already at the uh, lowest and we can go. Alright, we figured out the mysteries behind the void. So, it now clears the room. Well, not clears the room, but does a good amount of damage. And it gives me one pill. I think it's time we leave this accursed place. So I guess that's a nice way to get rid of unwanted space variety. Just suck them up and get the benefit every time you use it. I suppose this could become quite odd combinations if you get a lot of these. Curse of the Maze. Boom, he's gone. He's dead. Gone. What? 
Walnut. That's a hard nut to crack. Well, we'll use it. We don't really need health regen. We can get from um, the fork anyway. Right then. Ooh, unlimited bombs. Let's make good use of that. Um, okay, let's see if I super greed. No, and there's the almighty stopwatch, which we can't afford. Unless I want to blow up the, the thing again, sure. Probably blow up this dude while we're at it, right? There's plenty in the donation machine. I don't worry about it. And if my first run can be a victorious one, then why not, right? Find black hearts and whatnot in skulls, so that's why I bother blowing them up to begin with. Two clubs, double the bombs, sure. Probably should have used that once I actually left the room, but yeah, you know. Sun card. Uh, we're not taking it with us, I think, so yeah, let's just pop that straight away. Should be around here. Okay. Ooh, spiders. I always wanted those for Christmas. blow this guy up. More spiders. It's the happiest day of my life. <laughs> okay. Enough lollygagging. Uh, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. we get a pill Brr. which we got from uh, void but apparently not a single consumable dropped quaint oh come on now he's being annoying like legitimately annoying uh, I think it's worth going in there but ouch well at least I don't have to open that again What do we get? Bracano, just pop that straight away. Able. Eh, we can get it with a bomb, so I'm sure. Uh, we can get these out with bombs too. I'll try to remember to go and pick those up. I know that generally doesn't hold much water. Uh, do you have to think about the fact that I have to... Uh, what was it again? I was going to say something important. Oh yeah, I can't leave uh, the boss fight here, so if I want to go for that, I will have to go grab that stuff right now. I will uh, face off against Mom again. Good old Mom. The timer, okay, so I don't need to worry about going after Hush either. I should never be concerned about going after Hush, but you know, save files. Uh, surprise, it's all gone now. Yeah. I thought about doing some stuff of that off camera, but might miss out on uh, new items and whatnot, so. Yeah, this is definitely the place I want to be in. I don't think my speed stat is uh, doing alright. What pill is this? Power pill. Alright, let's go. Chuck some bombs here. Yeah, I'm still hoping to get a, a black card out of this at some point in my life. Still got some skulls here. That was a lot louder than I remember it being. Um, 
Yeah, alright, let's go. Oh, mom. When will you ever learn? We'll take the Polaroid. We're accustomed to that one. Faith chosen. I make it sound so ominous. Curse of the Unknown. We don't know how much health we have. I don't think we're going to spend too much anyway. Amnesia. Great. Now we don't have a map either. It's overrated anyway, right? <clears throat> so it looks like we're gunning for a victory. Tap on wood. Could you like open your gob now? Whenever you're ready though. There you go. Apparently they can't see if you don't move. What a world. Get dunked on. Wow. Explosive diarrhea. Well, it's nice to see you can still ball out of control like this. That's one of the few things I missed from Enter the Gungeon, you know. You could get a good amount of, <coughs> of items, but nothing as zany as this. Oh, great. Alright. Um. Meh. Not really sure what all the. Uh, let's take the monkey paw. Maybe it'll save my bacon. Maybe it won't. Couldn't tell you if I wanted to. Nope. Denied. Okay, money, which really doesn't help me. Well, there's a luck up there. We got the keys, you might as well. Uh, this switches out items, I think. So I'll go and leave that there. Okay, that nearly hit us. There's our boss, let's see who it is. Teratoma, you shouldn't live very long. And he did. Okay, so that's crap, I'm leaving that. Uh, let's open these, I guess. Ooh, wow, wow. Well, there's victory for us. Alright, let's see if I'm right about that number four there. If I can find it, and I did. Let's see if that item changed into something a little bit more useful to us. Yep. Cheers up. Scarred Boom. Look at all that health. Mm. Interesting bit being if I found a health pill right now, I'd probably take it. Okay. Yeah. Gotta love being powerful in this game. And it's so much easier to be powerful too. Okay, who's still coming at me? Who is it? Who is it? Come on. Where? Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Be a hero. Ah, yeah, ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Kind of wanted to stab him with a knife, but the knife didn't seem to be doing much. So, you know. And there's still a room down there. There's no reason for me being here. And we can fire rather quick too. Cool. <coughs> Damn golf. Oh, I do apologize for that. 
Dead. And a bullet hit me, didn't it? Health down. Ah, Good for you. I have no idea what it does, though. But I'm glad you're happy. Or at least excited. I'm kind of hoping that... Since everything did unlock again... Um, oh, I didn't even see the dude. Just bam, there he was. We would have been dead if it weren't for all the spirit hearts we've gotten from Satan, I think. So thank you, Satan, for making this a reality. Oh, those spikes weren't there when I opened it. Shenanigans. Shenanigans, I tell thee. I don't think. If you go. I think this helps me. And I oh, it does. Want to get brimstone? Let's get brimstone. I wonder how this works, though. Yeah, just willy-nilly fires everywhere. Wonderful. As long as it occasionally fires forward, too. Alright, let's go up. Because that's where we need to be. <clears throat> and we should have the Polaroid invisibility proc every single time we get hit. No infant bombs, and I don't really care too much about that pillar. And it all fired backwards. Not really what I was going for there, but I'll allow it. What else can I do, right? Got hit by the double beam. So I'm kind of looking forward to getting to the chest along with the void. If we get some spacebar items in those early starting chests, then we could get some really freaky things going on. Look at that double hit. Thanks for the spirit heart, at least. Okay, so if a chest drops, don't be an idiot and jump straight into it. Wait for it. Pretty sure that was just put in there for that exact reason. now. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. But never a third time, right? Beep, beep, beep. Ah, he did hit me. Health is starting to drop. I still th think our chances are okay in winning. Missing poster can resurrect me as a lost if you die again. But um, I think the paw here might grant me even more. Unless you need to be at half hard, in which case it's kind of pointless. So. There's that. Oh, you managed to get the dude out? Jeez. What do we get? Neuralgia's rune. Good. We'll use one on this boss fight. We'll use one on the last boss fight. Don't do that. Don't do that. I will murder you. All you need to do is find the boss fight. Oh, great. Well, let's go hug him, I guess. So we find a boss fight pretty quickly, or at least get another K 
cast injection. Cast injection. Uh, do we want to get Bob's head into this mess? Sure. Let's do it. Okay, where does the bomb go, though? Just use a pill. Speed down. Sucks. Do. Okay. <clears throat> I think that wouldn't have caught me off guard as much as it did, but kind of did. So, boss room, where art thou? There you are. Just need to take care of uh, Loki here. All right, come on, let's do it. I'll juice. See if we can get the knife in as well. Who do you think you are, huh? <clears throat> Sweet. All right, let's get the other Alge's rune now. Um. <clears throat> I think it was up here, but I can't be certain. There it is. <coughs> Resistance. We'll go get the battery as well, because we are going to get some more items to go. Boop. Let's see what we get. Still wondering whether the monkey paw is going to start pulling its own weight or not. Whee! Curse of the Maze! Uh, there's one new item in there. He's mis Is that he's mascara? Mom's eyeshadow, charm tears. Okay. Little Chad is pointless, but yeah, there he is. Varicose veins, I'm leaking. Ew. <coughs> okay, please don't say that anymore. Now we've got purple brimstone. Yeah, kill each other or leave me out of it. <coughs> kill shot. Ooh, new pill. Addicted. <sighs> well, this ain't good. Yeah. Alright, we don't have many hits left in us. On the bright side, we just need to get to Blue Baby and we win. Assuming that is still the end, I, mean, I don't know. Bob. We can't bomb through doors anymore, either if I recall correctly. Don't bother, Dingle. You're a dead man. What is that? Get it! Sulfuric acid. Acid tears. Alright. Add it to the pile. <clears throat> oh my god, the dude up top just got vaporized. Oh, jeez. Uh, panic, 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 panic. I don't remember what this guy does, let alone two of them. I think that's the guy with the curly brimstone, so if I can get him, like, dead... Yeah, there we go. Perks. Uh, let's keep going. Hope that we are going in the right direction. No spikes, good. Uh, toot toot. Toot on touch, whatever. Barg. Blarg. There you go. That half and a half? Can I pick that up? Ooh, it actually gave me a full one. Sweet. Ooh. 
Well, don't mind if I do suck this one in. Wait, what happens if I use it first? Um... Cool. So what's this thing again? Amnesia. I do not have amnesia at the moment. Alright, we're good. Rarg. Alright. Meow. Bar. Larg. Spray it all on. Why not? You and your little homing shots. Don't do that. Berg. I'd rather have the um, green guy live, but um, yeah. Amnesia. Forget about it. Almost hit me there, boot. Boot? Did you say boot? Sure. Let's roll with boot. Well, it's nice to know that after all these years, I still got it. Uh, we'll use this in the next room to get the spirit heart. That we just lost. Algiers. Yeah. What's this pill then? Lemon party! Ow! Really? Well, we can go suck that one in too. I think there was a battery somewhere. Yeah, in the next room. <clears throat> means every time we use... Oh, crap, I didn't mean to be in here. My hands weren't even on the controls. Or at least not on all of them. Blarg. As I was saying, every time we use uh, the Void now, we will get a Black Heart, a Spirit Heart, a... the um, Grandpa's Head, and Bob's Rotten Head. Two heads and two books. Makes perfect sense, doesn't it? Suck it in! Oh yeah, we get a pill too. <clears throat> Not that I'm really looking forward to the pill itself. Alright. Off you go. And let's finish this. Ow. Lasers, more lasers, and you're dead. No achievements because remember I was playing as Judas, unfortunately. <clears throat> All right, see if we got a different ending. Nope, just your everyday ending. All right, well that's gonna do it for my return to the Binding of Isaac after Plus, but I mean with this first run. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you're going to enjoy the series. Feel free to subscribe, comment, liking, and or selling if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys on next episode. Bye everyone.